good morning. It's 7.46 in the morning and I'm already cooking. Um, I got some salad going on here. And I did get the bag salad. I know some people have mixed feelings about it. I did check it and I saw it wasn't any, any bugs in there. You know, it's good to wash it again. And then I think um, in this container, I'm just going to put, uh, cut up some cucumbers and tomatoes. Spaghetti boiling. I had uh, picked up a, like a pound and a half of ground beef. So I'm trying to figure out. I think I'm gonna make sandwiches, and that's the food line version. And spaghetti because that way we'll have some food for the next couple of weeks. Not weeks. <laughs> salt on this but since we're trying to be healthy I'll um, put some of dash on there healthier we're gonna try Mrs. dash this is it's salt free so Put a little of that in my cucumbers. It's cucumbers, just cucumbers and tomatoes. So this would be a good snack. <clears throat> and this is to go with dinner. And you can use as much as you want of this because it's just herbs. And it's got orange peel and oregano, parsley, celery, garlic, carrots, coriander. Oregano, I think I said that, cumin, mustard, rosemary, pepper, so, but no salt, so. And then I always just shake it up. Just always shake the salad. And it's cool, too, if you can just you can put your dressing in there and just shake it up. 
McDonald's used to have those mix shakes or something they call it. And I used to like those. Just put the dressing in there and shake it up. So we got that going on. I've got um, spaghetti boiling. And I might come back and show you what everything looks like. Alright, y'all. I don't know if y'all can see that. I think you can. But I've got the ground beef cooking. And uh, I put up um, a lot of herbs in there. I'll just take you around to my lovely spice rack, you know. I was so proud of. Because I always wanted a spice rack. I used, um, I actually tried a little, this ground fennel. And I used marjoram. I used a little sage. Now, what do you guys think about sage? They say sage is supposed to get rid of negative energy. And I used thyme, basil. I love a little spice rack. And what do you guys think about, you know, being organized and getting rid of stuff you don't have? I try to do that. Um, you know, it's good to donate things too when you don't need them anymore. went to Aldi yesterday and they have so many um, cheap things. And I said I need to remember to go there more often. I do have that video on the Aldi haul I did a few weeks ago. Really, you know, it saves you a lot of money. I went to Food Line this morning because it's on the way uh, right down the street. I'm taking my son to school, so I just usually stop there. And the lady, the cashier that's there every day, I said, Does she ever get a break? Miss Mary Beth, she's like, what are you going to do? Are you going to make spaghetti and salad? I said, yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. I know she said sloppy joes because I had the can. And I said, I think I'm going to do both because I do have some spaghetti sauce. Um, I might plan to make from scratch spaghetti sauce one day. But not today. This is just something real quick. I wasn't even going to do a video, but I was just thinking... You know, try to get some people ideas you haven't thought about in a long time. Like, man, which I haven't had a good man which in a long time myself, actually. And we're just going to use, I didn't buy any hamburger buns. I didn't buy anything special. Um, we just got some regular old white bread here. You know, shoot, and this was 83 cents from Aldi. And I, um, now these chips are delicious. They were like a dollar 39 at Aldi's, also. And I had all these bags of tortilla chips. I just put them in, you know. And the doctor said put these things in individual bags anyway. She said there's supposed to be 10 chips in a bag. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, who could eat 10 chips? That's it. You know, put your servings in one bag, you know. I'm like, man, 
and you can do that. I wish I had self-control like that, you know. But you get a can of Pringles and you can eat the whole can. You know, the only time I can lose weight is when I'm in love. What's up with that? real good you start putting on weight they say that's that love weight that's that happy weight <laughs> I said maybe that's true I don't know alright so I'm trying to figure out should let me see I think I'm just gonna rather than open that can of spaghetti sauce I'm just gonna use this and you know the kids can make uh, the sandwiches and then we can have spaghetti. Sounds good to me. A little thick so I'm gonna add a little water. But um yeah that's what I'm gonna do. And how moms are we come up with this with these ideas. At the top of our heads, because I wasn't even planning on making I didn't know what I was gonna make. And this um 805 and I'm done cooking for today. That's what I'm talking about. I gotta try to figure out what I wanna eat for breakfast. I usually don't eat breakfast, and that's probably why um, they say the weight comes on too, because you don't eat. You know, right. A lot of times I don't eat breakfast, it's because, you know, especially you have to go to work in the morning and then your stomach starts bothering you, and, you know, the job don't wanna hear about that. Can't come to work because my stomach hurts. Yeah, right. Yeah, right, whatever. I think I want to have um, one of these. A little quicker. I don't know if y'all can see that. Quicker maple and brown sugar. I usually get apple. Cinnamon. Then I was at Big Lots the other day, and the lady said, "Why?" She said, you, "Everybody trying to be healthy through my line. These are seaweed snacks. What do y'all think about seaweed snacks?" Now this one was in a blue package, and it was roasted. Um, it was roasted, smoked, roasted something, and they were sixty cents uh, for the whole pack, but they had twenty percent off. And this is what they look like. They say you can use it as toppings or it tastes really fishy. Um you know it's an acquired taste, but it's only 30 calories for the whole pet. Yeah, this little girl, she got some bacon bits back here. You know. Short people, you know, these things are still any good. September, September 20, 2017. No, they not good. They got to toss them. What happened back in the days when they didn't have any dates on the they didn't have any dates on things and you just, you just ate it.
Yeah, remember that back in the days and had no dates on stuff. So that's what I usually do. I just put the spaghetti in the container like that. Um, sometimes I mix the sauce together. Either way, some people, you know, everybody has their way things and I'm just gonna um put a little bit of butter in there so the noodles won't stick together quick meals get it done get it out the way I got my tea from Dunkin Donuts it should be a crime to have a Dunkin Donuts so close to your house all right y'all so that's what's for dinner what are you guys having for dinner that's what we're gonna have we're gonna either gonna have it as spaghetti or sandwiches so or manwiches if you want to call it that so all right y'all hope y'all find something good to eat all right y'all